right, folks, we're back. More gameplay from Bakugan. Bakugan. I feel, I feel, so I feel like I should I should I'm gonna repeat this at the uh, at the end of the of the record sesh. But like, so we are not going to finish this game, at least not right now. We may come back later, but. What? I thought you were going to use the word Bakugan, but I wasn't sure if we used that already. Oh no, we did. We did. But we... this let's play can be Bakugan. <laughs> yeah, I... Like I'm freaking over with. Like... This, this is, this is... I'm probably going to, like, finish this game in my own time. Not this profile in the event, in the event that we do actually feel like finishing it. Yeah, the one that you're actually farther with, right? Uh, yes, I am... <laughs> I am ever so slightly further in in it. Can I? Oh, I can just go around them. I know I can't. Uh, uh, oh. I can't. I I can't. I just. <laughs> what is stopping me here? What is? Well, no, it does not. There really isn't. No, Mike, are you are you, are you saying that something that something was in here intentionally? <laughs> Every single design choice they make was a purposeful uh, has meaning to it. We did not try at all, just pure paycheck, pure paycheck. Oh yeah, just mash. Yes, we just we just keep going. <laughs> nothing, nothing happened. Of course. As we all know, scientists and ten-year-olds are at equal playing field in the realm of controlling giant monsters. Well, I was about to say, that's like anything, right? Like, I just love how it's like, like Pokemon or wherever, where it's literally just like, even the adults are just their lifestyle. It's usually, whatever game or, it's just the lifestyle is, and the, the game is just like, so, so intertwined that like, the adults are like factory workers and are like, oh, I'll fight this kid. Yeah. So that's usually a matter of like, just having, like, for gameplay's sake. Oh yeah, and it has to be like, uh, oh, work is cancelled because everyone is going to town to see the, the like, the, the Bakugan match. Yeah, the Bakugan. The Bakugan is. It's like the, it's like the Olympics. Except with more giant monsters. I, uh, you know for a fact I would too. Is Bakugan just a kaiju spinoff? I am not sure. Uh, I know it is. <laughs> I mean, they always had big monsters. True, but it was, uh, did they have, uh, big monsters with, uh, uh, with bad gameplay? <laughs> Mike, there's there's been trap monsters for a while now. If you catch my cold. Uh, is there actually traps in the reboot? I don't know. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, no. oh that's the. That's the. It literally gave up. Hang on, let me fix this. I have a, I have another one on standby. Just watch this one. Oh, also. Fuck, this one's also depleted! <laughs> Why do I have no controllers? <laughs> Is it, have you taken out like a Switch, like, pistol controller? Here we go, alright. <laughs> I am playing this with two Joy-Cons not attached to anything. This is... This is a new and interesting way to play the game. I would be so shocked. I don't know much that would be able to make this game better. Other than like a complete overhaul of the entire battle system. <laughs> Cause like this, this battle system just isn't fun. <laughs> it, it's, it, or it's fun for like 10 minutes and then it gets just grating. <laughs> What 
What's up, Chris? Yeah, oh, there goes my Trox. Also, if you could turn off battle animations. <laughs> I feel like the battle animations are fine, but like... But they take a lot of time, because you have a lot of them in each fight. Okay, but I think perhaps if Bakugan, like, had less health overall. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. At that point, I would just say, why can't we just control the box gun and fight with them? That's what I'm thinking. Like, did they do that? Like, that was a game they took out. That was a game. That, that was like the second box we got. Like, like, I almost said Champions of Astoria. No, that's this game. <laughs> but, but yeah, it was like something. Uh, it was a new Astoria game they came out with a while ago, and it was all right. Oh, yeah. I had it on the DS for a while, but then I. Got rid of it for no good reason. I know what you're talking about too. Yeah. It's, it's like a, a hidden memory, but it's there. Yeah. I remember I got stuck on like that. Like picked Bakugan, like you picked fighters. Yeah. I know I got stuck on like Nemesis versus Brontes or something. Oh my gosh. I'm getting cur. Oh. I'm getting kind of curb stomped. What? He's only been using like one Bakugan. Yeah, and then he switched to this one. And it's just hook. And I've lost two of my Bakugan. Yeah, you might just have to grind my. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I think I have been on my other profile, and it's and it's not great. Oh my god! Another thing they need to fix: the hit detection on these on these floor panels. Yeah, but will they ever fix it? Absolutely not. Will we do we blame them? No. <laughs> yeah, this game isn't really worth fixing. I gotta be not really a high priority for them, most likely. Just cause like, you know, they have other game. I would much rather them work on the next Shantae or something. Literally anything else. Literally anything. No, don't do that! <laughs> Yeah. But do it anyway. Give us a proper vessel fighters again. You know, I've been trying to actually just like pick up that game, and it is crazy expensive. Yeah, I've been hearing yeah. that. I've hear I've been hearing the DS games just in general have been skyrocketing for some reason. I mean, we're looking at like ninety to a hundred dollars for this I uh, To be fair, I did. I get like it has incredible reviews. For the for the for champions or for the original. Oh my god. Where, okay, hang on. Where are you looking? Uh, like, how much it is? Uh, just your standard, like, Amazon, eBay. Yeah, don't, never go to Amazon. They, like, almost never have the best deals. And if you do go to eBay, try and find it, like, for an auction. That's usually a good way to get a good deal. That's how I got my Game Boy Color for, like, 50 bucks. <laughs> And it came with two games, so like, even more, even more <laughs> stonks. Yeah, all of them, all of the ones that are relatively cheap are either, it's like, they keep it Frontier, it's always Frontier, because the other ones are always like a hundred, first, like, at the very cheapest 80 bucks. Have you tried, like, going onto, like, GameStop.com? GameStop would have it pre-owned for $18, but it says not available. 
Ah. Oh. Yeah, I've been seeing that for uh, Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Which, the only reason I'm interested in picking it up is because one of my friends at school has been, like, lauding it as, like, as, like, an amazing game, and plus, it's, like, not in production anymore. It's you... Oh, but you don't like downloading games. Big games, right? Correct. I pr I, I'm okay with it if it's the only option. However, I'd prefer to have a physical copy. Yeah, I agree with that. Like, with Shantae... Like, most Shantae games, the only option is digital. Unless you go through limited run games, which is unfortunate because I love these games so much. The only issue is, uh, well, I, I told you the stupidest thing, which was when I picked up Overwatch. And Fortnite does the same thing, where they, they have the case, but it's, all well, they have is, like, a piece of paper that tells you the code. Yeah, that's, that's when you're really wasting plastic, because, like... At that point, just print a code card. Like, print a code card that you can just buy from Walmart. And I'm pretty sure they have those. Oh, it's gonna it's gonna come down to the wire, isn't it? <laughs> so along, so along those lines, anyways. As if, as if I was playing it. I would, I would, honest to goodness, like much rather play that game right now. All right, come on. Oh yes. We just barely scraped by. It's funny, I was thinking the same thing when I'm playing Bakugan. Not Bakugan, Digimon. Wait, does Digimon not have good animations? It, it at least has ones where it does the thing where... Where it, uh... It does the Fossil Fighters thing. Where it doesn't actually show them connecting, but... it like In my opinion, the, dam the, the, the animation is better overall. Yeah, it's like disconnected. Hmm. Yeah, that's workable. Okay, let's see. Do I have any improvements for Ventus Stealth? We're gonna try and. What does Ventus Mirage do? Uh... Have we asked who our favorite Bakugan was? Um, I don't think so. I mean, I, I, go, I, think, I can pretty much guess what yours is. Take a guess. <laughs> oh, is it Hydroid possible? No. <laughs> uh, dang it, sorry. I spoke out of turn. <laughs> Mike, you'll be executed for your crimes. <laughs> I, I, I already know that it's happening anyway. Just make sure. <laughs> <Me up. laughs> You mean Juggernoid? Isn't that the turtle one? <laughs> no, it's the turtle, yeah. You mean Juggernoid? What's the Juggernoid? It's Juggernoid, not Juggernaut. Everything has a Noid at the end of every background. It's like Digimon. <laughs> yeah, you're right, it is Juggernoid. Yeah. <laughs> I always thought it was just Juggernaut. Hey, the Japanese version is Juggernaut. Well, some, someone... Not Japanese, though. Someone goofed. <laughs> Oh yeah, um, Tigranoid. <laughs> yeah, all noids, all every single one of them, all noids. <laughs> Except Gorum. <laughs> In all seriousness, though, <laughs> my actual favorite is indeed Alpha Hydranoid. <laughs> Yeah. Heck, heck, the Hydranoid is pretty much the the mascot for this channel. I mean, come on, like a chainsaw belly. Oh, yeah. And it got, like, even better when it evolved to Alpha Hydranoid, because, like, that one... Wait a minute. Buzzsaw Stomach. 
Did they rip off Geigen? <laughs> oh my. What? We'll have to discuss this. We are actually out of time. So we'll have to discuss this next time. <laughs> Bye. Oh dear.